find L4, L5, lay it right here. Now I am on the spinous process, okay? And this is where I use kind of the thin arm and it's, I'm basically on that ulnar border of my hand, kind of right over that, and I want my shoulder and my wrist to be kind of one over the other, and my other hand comes right on top. So both of my fingers are facing forward, and I'm here, the other hand just comes right on top, and I just slowly sink down to where her end range is, to where I feel an end feel, and that's it. And I will do that a couple of times, and when I do this, I have to assess for two different things, okay? So those two different things are what and what? Pain and mobility, right? So, um, and our, what, will we, what will we be more reliable with? Assessing pain or assessing mobility? What do you guys say? Pain. pain. More reliable with pain. So that's the good news, because don't panic if you don't feel ah! <laughs> See, that hurts. You would all agree, right? But you might not all agree that she feels a little stiff here. So um, We want to find out when in her range does she have pain, okay? Does she have pain at the very end of the range, or is it at the very beginning of the range, okay? This going through the range is something that we call a stretch articulation. So this is not a mobilization treatment right now. I am doing stretch articulations to assess her mobility in where in the range she may have pain, all right? So stretch articulation over L5, over L4, three. Other, if you're feeling your uh, aortic, uh, uh, your aorta being shut off, um, your patient, your therapist is pushing a little bit too hard. So if you're feeling like throbbing or something like that in your gut when you're doing this, you wanna just back off a little bit with your hands, okay?